Hi medals, hi people behind you, hi whoever you are. If you hear any background noise again, it's my brother Tristan. Um, today is the 30th of August 2021. Oh my god. Um, and I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I am in a horrible bad mood. I was in an okay mood, now I'm in a terrible mood. But hey, in the spirit of being mad out of London, let's do some makeup. And because I've been liking my makeup videos, and this is my like fourth day, I think, of wearing makeup continuously. And I just want to do some makeup. Also, yes, my hair is knotty, I am aware. I will fix that later. Um, it gets very knotty because I have curly hair. Anyways, um, not speaking for everyone with curly hair, that's just my experience. Okay, anyways. So let's start off with some concealer. And I will tell you as much as I can in the basis of confidentiality as to why I am pissed off so I had a phone call give me a second I should look in the mirror for this really so if I look to the side I'm looking in my dressing table mirror right let's start doing this although on a positive note my makeup skills, I think, are getting better from just doing makeup constantly. Um, I mean, I could just be wrong, but I would like to hope my makeup skills are getting better. Um, learning to blend concealer every day. <laughs> but yeah, let's do some makeup. That looks decent. Right, next side before it dries up and leaves weird lines. Okay, so. Um, let's start from the beginning. So, I have been trying to get a job because, you know, money, if I'm being quite honest. I'm a human being, I live on planet earth, and on planet earth, human beings need money. So, I've been trying, I sound really sarcastic, you can tell I'm in a bad mood, anyways. I have been trying to get a job, and that isn't always the easiest for anyone, but also I have to consider my disability, it's just a fact of life, I can't I mean, I have to consider that, you know, in every aspect of my life. But if I'm going to be working a job, I have to consider my disability. It's just how life is. I should be looking in the mirror. I've just done that completely wrong. Oh, right. See, concentrating on makeup and talking, I don't know how people do it. Because, like... I'm either messing up my makeup or barely talking and doing it okay. So, but we're gonna try. Um, so, I was looking for a job and I, on this job search, ran into many walls. But I eventually actually get a text from someone I know saying that people are hiring and I'm like, hell yeah, I'll go to that interview. So, I go to the interview, um, I'm not going to say what type of work, what type of place or anything, I'm not going to give anything away because, you know, I'm trying to, anyone in real life who knows me probably knows this whole story, well not everyone, but a bunch of people probably know this story by now because I've been getting pissed off about it. So, um, go to this interview. Um, the interview was late, but they run a busy place, so I was like, you know what, that's fair enough, like, you do you, you know? Like, I wasn't actually annoyed about them being late, because I was like, yeah, they have a business, you know, I'm a considerate person, and I care about the fact that they have this business to run, so I don't care that they were late to my interview, but it's just a factor of the story. Anyways, so... They say about potentially hiring me and about 
going in for a trial and I do these trials but you know I stood and watched for about like five minutes before I actually started helping because let's be real I am the type of person that's not just going to stand around and do nothing all day that's not me you know I want to do makeup because I feel like it, Babs. Why do you feel like it? Because why not? Um, anyways. I think, I think you're lying. Just lost my train of thought. Sorry, my four-year-old brother's in the room. Um, anyways, so... I... can't remember what I was saying. Oh, yeah. I'm not the type of person to stand around and do nothing. So I started helping. Then they asked if I could do a trial at another place, because, yeah, so I did that, and then this place, they asked me to do two trials, I did them, then they asked me to do two more, which was suspicious, but you know what, I did it. And then they asked me to come in for a shift. Sugar monkeys just put concealer all over my thumb. That didn't go to plan, anyways. Um, they asked me to do a shift. They cancelled my shift. Haven't been getting back to me. I've been getting quite annoyed because, like, leaving me in the dark. Like, do I have the job or not, people? Come on. Like, you can't ask me to do work and not tell me if I'm actually employed. Um, so, yeah, it's been very stressful, very upsetting, very frustrating, it's been hard on my body, that's not their fault, that's just my body, but still, it's been hard on my body, um, especially because my hands have been not the best, but they don't know that, they don't even know that I have a condition, because I didn't tell them until I, I was planning on telling them, after I got the job because, and some people might think that's wrong, but discrimination exists and I don't want people not hiring me because of my disability, that's not fair. Um, if I can do the job effectively then why would you not hire me and I don't want people having opinions on me just because I'm disabled, you know, it's this whole thing. I don't want people to be like, oh, picking faults in me because I'm disabled so I wait I was going to wait till after I got the job, then tell them, because then if they like my performance anyway, why did the fact that I have a disability change anything, you know? Um, so yeah. So... Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah. So anyways. I'm mad because I was telling people about this, right? And sorry, I have to close my mouth to do this. People around me were telling me this is suspicious. Even I thought this was suspicious. They've been keeping me in the dark. Then I get a phone call. And someone who I know had phoned up behind my back, should I add, and talked to these people. Um, and I did not ask them to phone up, I actually told them against it when they mentioned it in the first place. But they did it behind my back, but they found that information, and the fact is the place is probably not going to hire me. Um, but why didn't they just tell me that, for God's sake, you know? And they were just going to probably leave me in the dark to fizzle out. Well, sorry, that's not how I work. Um, so, yeah. Very unprofessional, very annoyed, very angry. But, hey, no use getting angry. Just a fact of life. But I'm allowed to be annoyed because this has been an ongoing process. And, like, you know, leave me in the dark. Anyways. My base. Why are you doing the dark? Alright. Um. Oh, yeah, the voice talking in the background is a four year old. Um. 
my brother. Anyways, what was I saying? I completely lost my train of thought. Oh yes, let's do some powder. Oh, my camera battery's flashing. Nice. I'll be back to you guys. Camera was having a funny five minutes. We're doing a lot of gold. We have to have a darker look today because I'm in a bad mood and we want to reflect that to the entire world. Hmm. Let's use this darker shade. We're not going to go completely dark, but we're going to use a darker shade. So not this gold, but this like brown. Hi there. No, I am busy, Babs. What do you want? Oh, I have to choose something on the top. Look. It's coming on. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, one second, guys. The camera battery keeps flashing at me, which is very irritating. But yes, we're going in for a darker colour this time. Um... A brown instead of a gold. I was thinking of going like black eyeshadow, but you know, brown still darker than gold. Trying to make new. So, yes, and it's not the brown I do my eyebrows with. It's like a it's like a brownie gold, I guess. Anyways, woo. Now we need to add another tone, as all good people do. We're going to add some gold in there, because I can't resist. There we go. Okay. Knocking stuff over. Here we go. Are you done? No, I'm not done, Babs. I mean, I can't turn off the light. No, you can't turn off the light. I need the light on. Okay. Does the makeup look so far? Um, I'm going to turn the camera off to do eyeliner and mascara and lipstick. And I'll get back to you when the look is complete. I've decided. Okay, and this is the finished look. I just added some eyeliner, very thick today, and some lipstick. Um, let's get my phone torch. See the blue in my hair, such a vibe. Anyways, yes, this is my finished look, and I'm wearing these green trousers and this crop top. But yeah, that is the finished look. Anyways, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to become mad. What you were talking about? It's tomorrow. Anyways, yeah. thank you guys so much for watching. Subscribe to become mad. Join our course of madness. I'm Mad Aladdin, and I never say that. Oh, lipstick sticking to my hair. And until next time, goodbye. Have a lovely day.